Yo, what's up, guys? So, I wanted to talk about BTM7. There's a couple different records I wanted to talk about, but this one specifically. Um, so, I made this album. I was completely messed up. And I was like, yo, I'm going to make an album. So, I'm like making this record. And it didn't really have a lot of themes to it, but it had a lot of potential. So, what happened with each song was... I make them and then I sang on them and the singing was like the organic texture that it needed but the actual music itself is kind of just very subtle so when I made it it's like the two of them blended together perfectly and that's what made the album so it's not one of my it's it's kind of like a medium album like it's not like the best and it's not the worst it's kind of just like right in the middle so it kind of like carries a little bit of the rest of Beat Jam and then like a little bit of 4 but it doesn't really take away from anything so when I made it I was trying to make like another concept album but I was also trying to make something different so the actual album itself was completely like based on just how people can kind of feel like they're alone and you feel like you're in this one place and you feel like you just simply aren't able to withdraw from that and that's kind of where the album came from so it was kind of tricky making the actual songs because each song really defined that and it made it a little bit more easy to listen to but it made it more of uh, a difficult thing to initiate so that's kind of where the album came from um it was more like i made the songs i recorded the songs and then i tried to put them in a way that i thought would be efficient um not efficient but difficult so i wanted to make it so you're listening to this album and you're feeling what you're feeling and that is very important to me